Today, the topic is on orthopantomography, uh, also called as panoramic imaging. Uh, it is a technique that produces a single slice of image of the facial structures that include both the maxillary and the mandibular arches and their supporting structures. Uh, the first innovator for this uh, kind of imaging was Patero, which was then further commercialized by uh, Numata, who described the principles of panoramic imaging. Uh, it is a slice of an image. It, it is a curvy linear variant curvy linear variant of it, based on the principle of reciprocal movement of X-ray source and an image receptor around a central point of plane called as the image layer, in which the object of interest is located. <laughs> the principal part of imaging is that the object is the is that the object should be in the uh, focal trough, a particular area beyond which or behind which if structures are present, they tend to be blurred off or out of focus. The main indications for uh, OPG imaging are for evaluation of maxillofacial trauma, location of uh, third molars, extensive dental or osseous disease, known or suspected large lesions, tooth development, especially in mixed dentition. Also, in case of retained teeth or root tips in edentulous patients, in case of temporomandibular joint pain, developmental anomalies, assessment of a variety of benign and malignant lesions affecting the jaw bones, and also for assessment of age in forensic odontology. Its advantages include a broad coverage of jaws and teeth, making it a perfect screening imagery. It uh, alludes to a very low patient radiation dosage. Uh, it has the convenience of examination of the patient and it has the ability to be used in patients who are unable to open their mouths, for example, in case of uh, trismus or a locked jaw, or if there is a trauma-induced uh, inability to open the oral cavity. Also, this imaging system requires very short time for it to be completed, and the image also can be obtained in a very short time. The patient's ready understandability of panoramic films, useful visual aid in patient education and case presentation. However, it is not without its limitations, which include it does not display the five and fine anatomy detail available in uh, intraoral periapical radiographs. Other problems are unequal magnification and geometric distortion across the image. Uh, especially if it is uh, in front of or behind the focal trough. And occasionally, the presence of overlapping structures, such as that of the cervical spine, can hide odontogenic lesions, particularly in the incisor region. This is an image of an OPG machine as it has evolved over the last 30 years. Thank you.